I'm not sure if it counts as stolen valor to call myself an ODST because I've been at Walmart during Black Friday pre-pandemic, but either way, I do know what it feels like to drop feet first into hell, and also what stabbing a man through the lungs with a dull butter knife sounds like. It was a long night, and I wanted that fucking toaster. So naturally, when I heard that Halo 5 had fucking ODST Slayer again, I hopped right on to relive the glory days at Walmart. It was a jarring experience. I'm used to being absolute shit at games and always being the bottom of the scoreboard, but for some reason I just sort of vibed with this game mode and topped slash nearly topped my team every game I played. Hell, this even transferred over into some other Halo games during a stream later that day. More about that later. Without further ado, here's some of what transpired. Uh, emphasis on some, by the way. Definitely gonna include the remaining footage in a later video and also later in this video. Like, this would have been so much nostalgia for me. This is probably, like, my favorite Halo 5 game mode by far, because, like, Warzone always turns into a clusterfuck where it's just, like, wow, I, I've gone 8 to, like, 28 because some dude camped our only spawn anywhere near the objective with a fucking tank for half an hour. And you got this, where it's just, like, everybody has a TAC mag, everyone has a silenced SMG. You can find a Brute Plasma Rifle and a Covenant Carbine somewhere. And there's occasionally a Sniper or a Rocket Launcher. It's a Spanker, by the way. But other than that, it's pretty even. And I can absolutely slaughter. Like, uh, let me just show you real quick my uh, previous game. <laughs> I went 17 to 10. That's good for me. Of course, there's this guy who went 22 to 9 to single handedly win that game. Oh, if we can just find me a game. Oh, we're gonna be on precinct, but it's gonna be unbalanced teams, so like, I didn't mean to do that. It's gonna be unbalanced teams, though, so this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Am I, am I about to have to make up for two? I, I can make up for two players. I can, I can make up for two players in this game mode. Slayer. Also, if you hear me chewing on anything at all, it's because I have a whole bag of dum dums and a baguette. Is that a weird combo of foods? Yes. And I'm on the team that's down a player. Of course I am. Alright. Alright, I gotta kill credit. And then there's an actual kill. Come on. Alright, I'm gonna go push him. Hope I don't die here. Should be a guy up here. Oh, nice. So, one of the enemies has a shotgun, which is concerning to say the least. Where's that brute plasma rifle again? I really like those bitches. Looks like somebody might already taken it, unless I'm misremembering where it's supposed to be. Yeah, somebody's already taken me. I gotta worry. I gotta watch out for that shit. Just worry about somebody behind me, no? Oh shit, I'm about to have to... Won't be one to hammer with an auto mag. But... Somehow that shit worked. Uh... Oh, baby, yes. This thing is lethal as hell.
That guy pushing me isn't. I got him. Oh, they finally got me, but... <laughs> I think I made him work for it. <laughs> I think I might have made him work for it. <laughs> I love the brute uh, plasma rifle in this game. I cannot understate how much I love this gun in this game. I'm just gonna check that that direction and just assume there's somebody there probably. Weapon pad in ten seconds. Wait, no, this could be close range. What am I doing? Nah, I fucked that up. Weapon pads open. Under attack on that was my bad. That was my bad. I'm just checking for I tried to cross this. They're gonna be somewhere near someone near here, like that's just how it works. My spawns are always just shit. Yeah? Pushing them. Fucking hell, that grenade was good. Yeah, I'm still leading everyone in kills, so like it's chill if I get killed a few times. Like, we're still doing good. I am still the reigning king of this server. That wasn't quite a perfect kill, but close enough that I'm willing to just let it slide. Well, at least I got an assist on that one. I'm out of grenades, so I'm gonna have to just sort of like... Hope and pray on this one. I have one hope, and it's the enemy's being brain dead. Is it gonna work out for me? Apparently it is. How am I alive? There's a guy up here. Oh no, he dropped down there. This thing is so deadly, like... I hear a person. Holy shit! I'm gonna take this out coming into here because this is definitely a close range fight. Alright, let's get ourselves 10 kills then. Oh, you wanna hide in there, do you? Oh, here. Allow me to help you. Let me fix your problem with being a, an absolute pussy by bringing the fight to you. Nobody wants to fight me now. They're all like just dipping out at the sight of me. It's actually sort of depressing. I want to fight people. Well, I got him still. I'm not going to get the final kill, but I am going to get the fucking MVP. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Batman. <laughs> I'm not used to actually MVPing streams. It's actually... Wait, who the fuck got MVP over me? Hold the, hold the goddamn up. Oh no, was that mean I just didn't recognize my own skin? That would mean I didn't recognize my own skin. Wow. Wow. Anyway, it's 18 to 4, fuck yeah. <laughs>
Oh, I feel good about myself right now. I want to check my Arena Daily win back. I was uh, proud of myself in case you couldn't tell. Literally like my third time ever MVPing a team in a shooter. Like, ever. In my 10 plus years of playing games, I've constantly been that much of a bumblefuck. Now before we do more of that, I gotta get those views. And that means talking about Waterfall. I have some decently neutral views on it, to be honest. It doesn't feel like a Halo 3 map, but I also don't mind it being in Halo 3. I guess I'll reserve judgment of it until it actually enters matchmaking and I can actually play a game on it instead of just flying around in a soccer ball. Here's some footage so that the title isn't clickbait. This is literally just me looking at the map for the first time in-game, like, myself. It wasn't my first time seeing it, but like it was my first time looking at it myself in-game because I hadn't booted up my Xbox in several days while I was waiting on this PC because I just was anxious. So let's just explore this map with the auto mag and see what we can find here, eh? Mm. Power drain here. There doesn't seem to be that much performance issues for me. I mean, I don't see anything. And this map looks beautiful. Holy fuck. This is a perfect blend, in my opinion, of, like, Halo 3 and Halo 4 art style right here. Like, I like this. I like this shit. Oh, no, I saw a lag spike right here. I'm on an original Gen Xbox, by the way. So, like, right here, if I look in this direction, I get... I can see there's frame stuttering. Like, I see that my frames just drop. It seems just this thing is really intensive, like the lighting right there is just really hard on, like, processors. They can fix that, though. Just tone down the aesthetic a bit and it'll be fine. Oh my god, look at that shit. Yeah, that right there is taking a lot. This is this is causing some issues. Hmm. Hell yeah. To take these two along for the hell of it. Is that basically what I was just playing with? Oh, I forgot in this game you can dual wield these bitches. That's right. I can. It's gonna kill me. What is down here, anyways? Where does this go? Oh, we're back here again. Oh, this is a cool map. I like the layout. No, I think I like this. Uh, if they can fix, like, the frames dropping. If they can just fix the frames dropping, like, we'll be fine. We'll be chill. Let's take a flying tour now, though. Like, look at that. Just look at that box. That skybox, and, like... Is this a physical pelican that I can go near? Or is there gonna be a kill barrier to stop me? Yeah, there's a wall stopping me, damn. Alright, frames drop when looking at that, but that's no surprise, that's that's a lot of geometry right there. And that waterfall is, like, very intensive, I'm sure. And then, like, again, we got this spot, and it's just like, this is beautiful right here. Like, this shot right here is perfect for, like, this could be a, like, a menu screen. Hmm. Like, that's just good. Uh, just a second.
Sorry about that. You can spawn a wrecked warthog? Huh? Excuse me? This thing drivable? No, but the... Turret works. So I guess it's basically just a mounted turret that you can't demount. Yeah, there went the turret. That's one of my gun back, my guy. So there is a battle rifle here, and there's a silenced SMG and a brute plasma rifle, all on the same map. Which means that this is definitely a auto start, making the battle rifle a power weapon. Hell yeah! I like that philosophy. I think I said a battle rifle should be treated more often. Yeah, that again. Well, I've been thoroughly convinced. This is a good, this is a good one. I like this map quite a bit. But now comes the fun part. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming. As I was saying earlier, this newfound vibing transferred into Halo Reach a bit. Not nearly as well, mind you, but it did transfer over slightly. It didn't happen at all in Warzone, though. Don't ask about what happened in Warzone. God, Warzone's such a disappointment. I'll operate the Scorpion turret. Let's go. Lost the lead. See, with this, you have to be ready to completely commit. I'm just gonna go ahead and be firing. Oh cool, I, got, I finally killed somebody with the, Gain the lead. massive turret. No, we're laying together. Homies in battle. We'll take this thing, come on. Hell yeah. Oh, don't flip over on me. I think we got him. No. No, I didn't see him. That was my bad. However, I think I could. If I play that shit real safe, I can... Okay, X is reload in this game. It's not RB like in... If he gets a headshot, I'm dead. Yep. The thing was, I de-scoped him and he still had full accuracy for some reason. 
Okay, I should have got assists for, like, landing a hit, but, like, knowing the way that reach works, it's probably not gonna happen. Something shot me from this direction. I want to know what. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> Can I get a woot, y'all? No, you don't. Somehow I survived that shit but I'm immediately going to die, because there is a tank. Uh, Barton, I'm going to go ahead and say, boy, it ain't safe for you here. Why did I not melee? Hold up, I hit B. Why, did, why the fuck did I not melee? Oh, it's right bumper. I'm, I'm too used to playing fucking Halo 3 now. Revenge. Okay, just a fucking side note here. What the fuck? fuck is a woot ya and why why did i say that i i don't understand why 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 did that come out of my mouth i i don't get go ahead pop up my guy no you don't I was gonna try and take that tank. I was gonna try and take it. I was gonna try and fist fight that fucking tank. On jaw. On jaw. I was gonna fucking fist fight that tank. Oh, am I about to get zooted by this thing? Oh, it's Robernator 3. This fucking piece of shit was still shit at playing on the ground. He had to. He had to break out the fucking Banshee. To keep Start getting killed. This Robinary guy's gonna get on my nerves, isn't he? He's literally camping our spawn for kills and farming. Fucking bullshit, man. He gets fucking steamrolled the whole time. He gets a banshee, and all of a sudden he's getting fucking killtaculars and shit. Come the fuck on. Alright, I'm just pushing through here trying to find out where the fuck we can get a vehicle to kill this fucking son of a bitch. Where is the fucking rocket hog? Go fuck yourself, you rotten piece of shit. Is that him again? Probably because of the fucking Banshee bullshit. I'm just gonna camp this Banshee and... Ah, 
if I pull it out of here and don't have a gunner, I'm going to get instantly obliterated. Yeah, please take that. I'm such a shit driver. Apparently not as bad as you. God damn. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Shit. Fuck. Give me in there so I can fire this bitch. I tried to get out in time, I couldn't. Ew, fucking Robernator again, this fucking son of a bitch. He just keeps Five finding the cheese, the fucking most cheese strategy. And just running that shit as hard as he can. God damn, that was- I still did okay though, 15 kills ain't that bad for me. So after accidentally playing a game of Warzone in Reach, I was sorta of tired and stopped streaming for the day. That would be the end of the video if I had any sense, but y'all are lucky because I have no goddamn sense. Back to making rookie look like a rookie. I already knew it going in. Maybe it's the previous map and I'm just forgetting like what it was and like people are going to yell at me in the comments of the video. I could let me Google it real quick. Slayer. I can do the reading next time I die. Okay, I actually got play now instead of looking at shit on my screen. Let me switch back over to chat real quick. Oh, I got the first kill of the game. Oh, this is that one map from ODST. Fuck yeah. Did he stick me? I thought he did, but nope. You gonna try and push? They better the fuck not push. <laughs> Jesus. It's an absolute slaughter here. <laughs> Fucking hell. Back up. I'm like Chin from fucking Hong Kong 97. I'm killing all those dirty fucking reds. Unless I try and close quarters a shotgun and miss all my shots. Then, then I'm not. Then I'm not. Then I'm getting, I'm getting my shit slapped. All right, let's try using the carbine. I feel like the carbine's a fun gun. Let's try using the carbine. All right, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna chuck and then, basically it's more shots from a magnum is what it is, basically. Hello, buddy. No, no the fuck you don't. I'm going to run your shit. Even if I didn't kill you, I still got you killed, motherfucker. Not going quite as crazy as last game, but it's still crazy enough that I'm happy with it. Like, me going 5 to 2 is, like, good for me, at least. Like, when you consider that I normally struggle to do, you know... Well, I mean, I got a double kill and then got my shit slapped. I, I got my fade run, so like... Who really won? I got two, you got one, motherfucker. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit. Some dude cracked me in half. How do I keep getting grenade kills is my question. You never get grenade kills in Halo. Everybody's aware of the grenade spam and just, like, stays the fuck away. And I somehow just got stuck with a grenade. Giving them the lead. Are you actually fucking with me? 
Oh, Jesus, fuck. Okay, they're gonna be coming that way, so I'm just gonna go ahead and chuck that for good measure. Pick up the shotgun and see if I can't just... Well, uh... Gain the lead. If I was capable of losing a gunfight, I would. Ah, oh, shit. I heard it behind me and was just like, what's that? And then instantly found the answer. Don't stand still in this game, is, is the moral of the story. Just do not stand still for any reason. I'm about to get my shit slapped by somebody over here, aren't I? No? Okay. And ain't nobody running the, uh... fruit rifle. Oh, well, shit, where I meleeed, I fucked that up. I could have killed him if I hadn't meleeed. I'm still technically MVP of the team if we win, but like... Oh, I thought that might have been that, but... I feel like we're about to run into someone. I feel like right here is a place where there has to be people. Go ahead, die. You got me, but at what cost? You could let me go, and I probably wouldn't have killed you because I was scared shitless and just trying to survive. I'm gonna go this way and hope there are people. I'm gonna go this way and hope there are people to kill. There probably will be. Pick this up that way there's more percentage. You know, popping out into open here with a close range weapon was probably not the smartest idea I have ever had. Maybe don't get in the way of my plasma bolts if you don't want to be shot. Novel idea, my guy, but... Again, this is just a monster at close range if you land all of your shots, like... Like right there, I knew I was gonna win that. Now, that, that third party there caused some problems, but... But like... Still, the raw killing potential was maintained. I think there has to be a guy here. I think that I'm going to grab this and jump up and absolutely run your shit. I think that's what's going to happen today. What, did you think something different was going to happen? Do you have any disagreements? I don't think it matters if you disagree, because you're already dead. Yeah, no. No, you don't. No, you don't. That shit just does not happen. There's a guy over there. Yeah, you get moving in case there's... I landed all my shots. The question is, will a grenade get me? guy right there. You have to try and go for the master flank here. Next kill. And I pulled off the flank. My question is, am I going to bump into somebody before anybody else does? The answer is probably not, but a strong maybe. All things considered. 
That's right, you motherfuckers better run. <laughs> I just watched that man run into gunfire. And how did I get in the back even though I'm in, like I'm like definitively MVP? And that's it, I think, for now. Definitely gonna make another video with the existing footage from the ODST Slayer stuff and whatever footage I gather when Game Pass for PC finally begins working. It won't install to an external hard drive because of DRM bullshit, so I have to wait for a separate internal hard drive to arrive before I can play the games I'm literally paying a monthly fee to be able to play. Fuck you, Microsoft. Anyways, shit was crazy. See y'all next time.